everyone, it's Spoonful for you, back at you again with another video. And today, I am making another brand new Save Splash Mountain video. And shockingly, I'm talking about a topic that I've really never wanted to talk about before. Because honestly, I think it ruins the magic of what the Disney Imagineers do. And this is ride manufacturers. So, when I look up information on Disney parks, I never really think about who manufactures the rides. I think about who, you know, comes up with the storylines and the, the plot and the characters for the ride. Because I think thinking about who makes up the ride, like building it, kind of takes me out of the magic. But before we jump into this full video, let's hit 10 likes on this video. It would be hugely pre appreciated. But nevertheless, let's continue. Now, Hopkins Rides is the manufacturer for Splash Mountain and Disneyland. I'm unsure if they are the same in Florida and other places around the world, but in Disneyland, these are the ride manufacturers that basically manufactured Splash Mountain. Now, we should basically care a lot more about manufacturers than we do. Most people don't even think about them. We all think about Disney Imagineers, oh, it's Disney, it's this, it's that, but Hopkins Rides, they contributed a lot on this attraction. And if it wasn't for them, we would have never had this smooth flume experience that we have today. I'm very happy that they collaborated with the Disney parks to create such an iconic attraction. And I think their work should be remembered and carefully preserved. Even though Princess and the Frog will use the same vehicles, as far as I know, and the same track, as far as I know, it's still pretty unfortunate because these guys worked on Splash Mountain. These guys did not work on Princess and the Frog. These guys should not be known for Princess and the Frog. They should be known for their work on Splash Mountain. Because, yes, it's good if they receive credit on whatever, but they... Back in the 80s, they never thought of there ever going to be a retheme. So Splash Mountain was their work. It was their passion project. It was their baby. It's basically erasing history. And I think we should respect, like I said, manufacturers a lot more because they are the final product. You know, you have Disney Imagineers that come up with storylines. You have Disney Imagineers that come up with great characters, great places, great locations. But... You need the ride, the ride manufacturers to come together with the Disney company and create something amazing. And I think this company did a great job. And unfortunately, it doesn't receive enough attention. I never ever hear people bring up the ride manufacturer for the ride. It's all about the Disney Imagineers. It's all about Tony Baxter. But I think that Hopkins rides should re receive recognition for the work that they did. And I thought this would be a very interesting video, something new that I've never really covered before. I was thinking of something basically to cover. And I was like, you know what? I'll cover ride manufacturers because it's something unique that I've never done before. And I think these people, these guys, like I said a million times in the video so far, they deserve the credit. And Splash Mountain would not be here without them. But of course, you know, we can't forget about Tony Baxter. We can't f forget about the Disney company and uh, how amazing everyone just, a great job that everyone did on this ride. It was truly a, fantastic. And uh, I love Splash Mountain. I, I adore this ride. It is a fantastic attraction. And we must fight for it, ladies and gentlemen. We must preserve it. We must just continue on to spread the message that this ride is not racist in any way. It's actually something beautiful, something that should be cherished. And I think that we can all preserve this ride if we come together, end the hate, end the SJWs, come together as one, and destroy cancel, cancel culture. Because if it's not destroyed, then I think we're doomed. I hope you enjoyed this video, everyone. Let's hit 10 likes on the video. Please, it would be appreciated. Thank you all, and goodbye.